Happy Monday, IOST community. This is Q, aka That Daft Guy, and I'm here bringing you another IOST weekly update brought to you by Sutler Ventures. Now, we do have a couple team updates to get to. We made our public wallets available to you uh, so that you can see all the transactions we're making with the Tier 1 node rewards that we received for Q1. Now, these addresses are Sutler Team, Sutler Legal, Sutler Vest, and Sutler Tech. Now, we've pledged to spend these rewards in a variety of ways, and it goes as follows. 45% to the marketing of an investment in the ecosystem, 30% to team, 10% for a legal reserve fund, and 15% for server costs and requirements as the network grows. The second piece of news is that the team is going to be in New York City for Blockchain Week, May 13th through the 17th. So if you're going to be in the area or you're going to be attending Blockchain Week, please drop us a line on our Twitter or Telegram so that we can maybe meet up at one of the many events that we've already RSVP'd to, maybe talk a little bit of IOST and blockchain in general. All right, the last piece of team news, I know that's a lot this week, is that we have a very major partnership that we're working on to be released this week or early next week. So keep a lookout for that on our Twitter, our Telegram, and even a YouTube video possibly. But we're super excited for this partnership and we look forward to bringing it to you. All right, so the first piece of news has to be about IOST Play, the gambling dApp on the IOST network. They ran an airdrop starting, I believe, on May 3rd that shot their 24-hour volume on May 3rd all the way up to 250 million IOST. That was an all-time high for our network. It was a number one rating on dap.review, on dap.com for the most volume across all dapps at the time. So a huge congratulations to them. That airdrop is still ongoing. So I'll put the link in the description to their Telegram channel where they clearly describe uh, the requirements for that airdrop, but it is a one-time airdrop for you betting on the platform. So if you want to get on over there to that telegram, I'll have the link in the description. Uh, otherwise, congratulations to the team and hopefully they will have sustained success. All right, so staying on the DAP front, we actually had announcements about two DAPs coming into the IOST ecosystem as early as mid-May, and these are going to be IOST Fish and Horse Saga. Now, reading directly from the IOST Fish announcement, it says IOST Fish extends traditional pet raising and collection onto the blockchain with a variety of things players can do, including raising fish, crossbreeding, trading, fighting, mining, and dividends. Now, apparently the team behind IOST Fish is very experienced, uh, having released an app that peaked at 3.3 million daily active users. Keep a lookout for IOST Fish on our DAP tier rankings list. I'm going to do a little bit of research on the team behind the project as well uh, and get back to you guys. Now, the second DAP announced Horse Saga doesn't have as much information as the first announcement as well as the team behind the project. It says Horse Saga is a horse breeding and racing game built on the blockchain where players raise and breed horses on their farms and recruit skillful horse racers to participate in games in order to win high rewards. So both of these DAPs are going to be of the digital collectible sort that you find popular right now among the other networks like Tron, EOS, and Ethereum. So shout out to the IOST team for increasing the quantity of DAPs in the IOST ecosystem up to this point. Now, the last piece of news is going to be an IOST announced partnership with the Nest Protocol. Now, reading directly from the announcement, it says Nest is a decentralized financial service protocol that allows developers to conduct application development and launch decentralized financial products on the Nest Protocol. Now, it's important to note that the Nest Protocol has been working on the Ethereum network and they have amassed over 10,000 users on their decentralized application as well as $6 million USD. Now, as far as how Nest and IOST are going to work together, there wasn't much information given in this announcement, but it does say that Nest and IOST will have an in-depth collaboration in the areas like decentralized financial products, application, and R&D to create transformational change in finance across the world. All right, so that does it for the weekly update this week. Please like, subscribe, and comment on these videos. The team loves getting the comments and reading them off on our weekly podcast. So if you do leave a comment, you'll make sure to get a shout out there. Uh, keep a lookout for the team in New York City, May 13th through the 17th. If you're going to be there and you want to link up, please hit us on our Telegram or our Twitter. Uh, otherwise, that partnership's coming in the next seven to 10 days. So I look forward to getting you guys that news when the time comes. I'll see you guys next week.